many of you know that I studied the martial art uh, Taekwondo for 16 years. I finally had to quit for a variety of reasons. Most significant was my muscles and joints just couldn't take it anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Among the many things I learned during this time, though, is something that applies to much of life. You get back what you put into something. You see, most of the students treated their lessons as a commodity, something that they were purchasing. And they not only, they, they had nothing truly invested in school other than some money. These students dropped out whenever things got hard, or they got bored, or they got offended, or if they were asked to help. <laughs> Those of us who invested ourselves in the school, helped by, you know, we helped clean the school, we helped with tournaments, we helped teach and encourage fellow students. And we ended up being foundational to the health and the strength of our school. Ironically, the non-invested students accepted our service as if they were entitled to our help. They thought that we were crazy for giving so much of our time and effort to the school. But you know, we never saw it as a sacrifice. And without looking for rewards, we got much more back than we ever put in. Now I find this principle true with church as well. There are some who, like the non-invested students, are in church to be served and ministered to, uh, treating the various ministries like, like a commodity. Then there are those who invest themselves into serving God through their church. These members give up their time, their money, their heart, and their love. These invested members are foundational to the local body, and without looking for it, they get back so much more than they put in. I'm thankful that each week we're given an opportunity to invest ourselves in the service of the kingdom of God. Let's pray. Father, it is a precious act of worship and a precious opportunity to be able to serve you by giving of ourselves. Take what we offer and multiply it to the needs of your kingdom. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. 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 <clears throat>